Good morning, everyone. Today is uh, Saturday. It is August 25th of 2018. And today, for my final vlog at Disney World, I will be going back to Epcot. But before we go, I'm just in my room packing up because we got to go check out our hotel. So, see you there. Before we get started, though, I want to take some time to show you some of the wall art that are inside the lobby of our hotel that I forgot to show you when I was doing my Around the Hotel tour. This is the 90s, which I've already shown you. But you can see a lot of articles for stuff that happened in the 90s. Like The Simpsons, Blue's Clues. God, I love that show. Pocahontas, oh God, Barney. Pokemon, Dick Tracy. And now we enter the 80s. All the old electronics. Very boxy looking computer. Oh, remember when they had those phones? And there's Max Headroom. There's also Michael Jackson, Tina Turner, Sir Elton John, Madonna, all great music artists. Phil Donahue, I remember when he was a talk show host. Okay, well I wasn't alive when Donahue was on, but I've heard a lot of things about him. All the other TV shows, there's Bill Cosby, Different Strokes, Magnum P.I., Dukes of Hazard. Oh look, there's Miss Piggy from The Muppets. The Smurfs, Jane Fonda, Arnold Schwarzenegger, fitness. That was all popular in the 80s. And there's Mickey when they opened Walt Disney World. God, he looks so different. And all the stuff from the psychedelic 60s. Groovy, man. Peace. Far out. And that's what we watch TV on. Those things. God, TVs were so junky back then. And in the 50s, God, take a look at that mic. Can you believe people spoke out of that? And all the things they used to make food with. And bowling, bowling was popular too. Here is Epcot. There is Spaceship Earth, the ball of tomorrow, as I call it. And over there is Club Cool, where I'll be going to do a Soda Saturday special which will be uploaded soon. Right here is Mouse Gear. I've already filmed inside that store on my last Epcot trip, so you know what to expect. Got mostly clothing and decor. And I also like the build of the buildings, too. <coughs> hey, guys, you ready for Test Track? Yeah. Yeah, cool. We got to make the most of our last that day here. Frozen ride was kind of cool. I didn't really enjoy it. I mean, if you enjoy Frozen, you'll enjoy it. Well, our car thing, boat slash boat, it got stuck. So I, um, it was stuck for like five minutes straight. So I stuck my hand out of the thing and I like pushed it off and I got it going. Wow. Come at me, Disney. Outside Epcot, you can find many beauties, like all these flowers that are grown. It's an amazing view of the lake right in front of it. Amazing shot of the ball right here, Spaceship Earth. I gotta stop naming it myself. And of course, World Showcase, which is where we're heading now. Heading out of Britain, we are now heading over a huge bridge that goes over the lake in front of Epcot. Look at the balloon. Hot air balloon. What balloon? I don't see any balloon. It's a hot air balloon. Do you see it? It's right there. The big hot air balloon in the sky. Oh yeah, I see that. That's amazing. It's huge. When it gets on the ground and you look at it, it's like huge. Yes, Billy Fusello huge to be exact. If you think my voice. Wow. When I say Disney dessert, I talk about this, the school bread. You can find it at the Norway Bakery. Uh, well, the caption's at the bottom of your screen for you to see, but this is delicious. It's called school bread. This part is obviously the cream filling. I'm telling you. Disney knows how to get it right. The U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce bountiful harvests now and into the future. The tropics are home to the greatest diversity of plants on the planet. Many of these, like papaya, bananas, cacao, coffee, and rice, are well known around the world. 
these are just a few of the edible plants that have been an important source of nutrition for people living in the tropics. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less than ideal conditions. The common grains growing here, wheat, maize, sorghum, and millet, plus rice, account for nearly two-thirds of our global food consumption. Learning how to increase yields of these staples is an important goal of research around the world. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests, like aphids and flies, we are significantly reducing our reliance on conventional pesticides. We're growing these crops using our nutrient film system. Mickey this had technique precisely controls and recycles water and nutrients. Oh, wow. It looks like it just rained here. I'm with these guys going to get some uh, Hi, yeah. ice, I think. And stuff from the no, shop. Big I'm returning my uh, lollipop here. I've already had some stuff to sip, so I'm just going with them for the ride. That's their food court. Eh. Yeah, you can hear thunder in the area. What? Oh, are we gonna go in the gift shop? Yeah, Fine. It leads, it leads, it leads, um, it's open right to the food court. So it's fun. Ah, yes, same with our resort, which we just checked out of. Epcot was fun, by the way. Yeah. Welcome back to downtown Disney, folks, or should I say Disney Springs in that matter. Atmosphere here is always great. Definitely shows the modern eras of a city to walk around and shop around. Heading us inside a Christmas shop over at Downtown Disney, looking for ornaments. A lot of these are classic Mickey heads with saying like stuff like 2018, my first visit, which is definitely something we, that we are not. That mini one's cute. You're looking for any specifics? I'm just looking really. I saw a couple that I liked at the other place, but. I like this one. Yeah, I do too. Look, it's the Unikitty stuff from the Lego movie. Wow. Yes, I'm inside Legoland. This is Lego Brick, uh, just one of the many of them. Ninjago, Lego Minecraft. Wow, they even have an ocean monument now. This is a cool Minecraft map. Wow, it's been years since I played that game last. Look at these things. There are a bunch of Lego brick heads. That's the Incredibles. That's Back to the Future. Oh look, in Minecraft, speaking of which, there's Steve and a Creeper. And there's Mr. Incredible and Frozone, like I just showed you. And there's Ghostbusters. There's a lot of other cool things to look at, too. I always love the LEGO Creator Cat sets, I mean. Perfectly fitting, because my channel's name is LEGO Guy Zero One. So after a long day, we are at our hotel, getting ready to leave for the airport very early in the morning. We're going to be getting up like around uh, 5 a.m. So yeah, going to be a long haul. But yep, the trip is over. I had a lot of fun. Just showing you the basic hotel room. Nothing special. Nothing like the Disney hotel. It's cut carpet, but that's fine. There's the bathroom and the shower, which I'll be taking in a few minutes while well, this video is uploading, actually. And there's your boy filming himself, filming himself. <laughs> but yes, I hope you enjoyed my Disney trip vlogs and cannot wait to be back in Albany. See you around.